Day day traders. This is a uh, day trader rock star, and this is uh, for March 10th uh, watch list. Um, going to do a nice uh, market update here. Also here to announce that I did get the 10 for a thousand watch list out. The special 10 for a thousand watch list. If you do go to www.daytradingradio.com. You'll see on the left hand side a uh, 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 sign up. For the newsletter, 10 for a thousand, 10 stocks to trade each week um, to generate a hundred dollars per per stock per trade to generate a thousand dollars per week. All right, it's probably the you know the best watch list out there. So uh, have an excellent one out there tonight. It's excellent. I can't wait for you guys to see it. If you uh, haven't su subscribed to it, definitely subscribe to it. Um, and uh, yeah, we're going to start off right here. This is actually a little bit on the watch list right now. Just to go over the markets right now. Uh, you see Friday we had a, a nice drop drop down, um, nice sell off. Uh, things were looking bad. Pretty much uh, we're on our ways to the January lows. All right, uh, January lows, low support is 11,647 was back in January. We actually had this tweezer bottom here, a very strong pattern here. Something we should talk about one day. A little tweez it's called a tweezer bottom. And you can see the long tails right next to each other. And it actually makes it what, what looks like a tweezer. And uh, the close on Friday was 11,893. So that leaves us about 246 points to get down to those lows. You know, I'm not saying we're going to hit it exactly, but it gives you an idea how close we are to January lows on the Dow Industrial. Easily can be taken out in one day. Uh, easy. You know, it could happen Monday, it could happen Tuesday, it could happen Wednesday. My um, my bet and my watch list is based on it. We're going to have a, a nice reaction rally coming this week. A big rally this week, so I'm looking forward to that. Uh, I got, like I said, I have some great uh, great stocks on the watch list. And this is basically to tell you that the watch list will I'm gonna I'm not going to do a, I'm not going to really do an in-depth watch list tonight because uh, I did such a good watch list on the uh, 10 for 1,000 tonight. But I will um, just let you know that what the market's looking at, looking like, and why I'm thinking we're going to see a nice rally here. Uh, different, couple different scenarios. I would love. I would love to see a nice gap down one someday, either Monday or Tuesday. A nice gap down. On any gap down, I believe that you're going to see some buying. So look for that gap down. You know, you notice my trading. I've been always, you know, for the last month or two, I've it's, I've been very, very, um, I've been. Very cautious on taking any big positions. You know, at the most, I was just looking at my uh, my positions today. I don't have more than uh, fifteen thousand dollars in 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 any holding in, in holdings in stock holdings right now, which is very small. And I think that's the key right here is uh, capital preservation. Uh, and then when the market comes down to a level where we're going to have a nice bounce, and I believe it is going to be this week, it's when you want to strike hard, and that's where you're going to make your money. All right, and I think we're going to get a nice violent ra rally. Um, I'm not, you know, each day we'll, we'll work on it, you know, figure out when it's going to come. It could come Monday, it could come Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. We're going to see each day is going to give us a different clue to it. But watch for it. I think uh, we're going to get into that area. Finally, we're getting down here. The stochastics are oversold. We're finally getting down under the 20, 20 area here. And that's very important because that's what I like to see. And that's what I was, I was waiting. That's why I was so hesitant when I buy stocks not to buy them until they get down below this level. All right, so now we're finally breaking down to this level. If we get a couple down days this week, we should be primed for a nice reaction rally. So we're going to watch that. It seems like everything's setting up. Let's take a look at the weekly chart here. Here's another interesting one. Look at this. We had the 200-period moving average. Back in January, we basically came down, spiked down, just about hit it, and then, uh, you know, and bounced way back up. Now we're just about coming back. And again, look at this. Is this coincidence that the 200-day, 200-week moving average is at is going to be at a double bottom low if we do hold that low it's going to be a perfect setup it's i mean that's just another great ind indication that this market is, wants to rally again on the weekly uh, stochastics getting into that oversold area so everything here is uh, shaping up really nice let me go back one more thing to the daily chart here uh, really pulling away from this 20 period moving average here every time we pull away from it we do get a nice reaction rally back so looking for that I think you're actually seeing that pretty good on the uh, on the uh, weekly chart here so all, all things uh, said and done we're gonna get a rally this week at some point so 
Um, have a lot of great stocks that I'm watching. It gives you, give you an idea. You can check out the watch list and sign up for the watch list to see the, the exact targets and everything. But just to give you a taste of what I am, I am looking at, uh, let's take a look at the BCH right here. All right, um, closing up to 52-week highs on the. Uh, let's take a look at the daily chart here. All right, everything looking really good. Over, you know, embedded sto stochastics up here, a nice consolidation. That's Banco de Chile. All right, um, another good one that's looking go good. EOC. Uh, again, same criteria. I did some special scans this th tonight, and uh, these scans gave me a lot of great setups here. So, I'm, I'm actually very ha happy about it. That's why I'm actually want to put out this video and just let everyone know. If you're not on the list, if, actually, if you don't, and that's another thing. I've been going. Through, I've been having trouble with the uh, email feed blitz, and I, you know, I've been back and forth with emails. This, and I know some people have been getting, you know, signed up late and are on the watch list. They already received the watch list. If you haven't received the watch list, it's because, you know, it's because there's putts, whoever he is. Excuse me if you're out there listening, but you need to get my shit together here. And uh, if you, he, hasn't, he hasn't added the, uh, the emails back onto the thing. It's just, you know, the server crashed. I lose everything. I tried to send him the backup list I have, and he hasn't gone to importing the list to it. And he's supposed to do it tonight, and he hasn't done it. So if you haven't gotten an email... My best suggestion is sign back up on the email list, and you should get an automatic send. It should be an automatic response of this email. I mean, of this watch list will automatically be sent out to you. And it'll probably be best to get back on the list anyway. So I would, that would be my advice. Get back on the list. If you haven't received the uh, watch list by now, it's 11.11 11, uh, p.m. on Sunday night because I sent it out about 9 o'clock. So if you haven't received it, then you're probably not on the list, and I've been waiting for this guy to import the list back, and he hasn't done it yet. So instead of putting it on the site, you know, just sign back up, and I would, you know, that would be nice. And or if they say you are signed up, you could actually look at the list if you just go to your feed blitz, and when you, you click on that, it'll say that you're already signed up or not. And if you are signed up, you can actually look at the list there on the link. So definitely check that out. Lots of good stocks. I got 10 stocks up there. And uh, also on my bounce list because I think there is going to be a nice rally this uh, week. Um, looking to uh, actually actually start to see a bounce in Google this week. Again, again, this one very pulled back uh, nicely off the 20-period uh, moving average. Oversold indicators all around. Actually had a nice uh, kind of an up day on uh, Friday. And I'm just looking for a higher high to take a position on this one. Goldman Sachs I also took a position in on Friday again this one's looking really good this is actually part of the watch list here and uh, this is what it kind of looks like so looking for um, a target of 168 to 170 on Goldman Sachs the buy trigger at 163.35 which is a two-day high breakout and this one's making a nice double bottom but again this is all on the watch list all right so um, just want to you know let you know the watch list is out if you haven't received it definitely get on the list or get in touch with me on day trader rockstar at iron action at yahoo.com that's iron action at yahoo.com and uh, definitely come by uh, the uh, site this is uh, day trader radio this is a little picture of the site here we have uh, a lot of great stuff on there here's the actually where the watch list you sign up I got free trader magazines there now uh, free uh, free uh, trial subscription to two good trader magazines actually a uh, business week and stuff all over there and it's pretty good offer there so it's a free trial like investors business daily it doesn't cost anything or anything so it's worthwhile checking that out i got educational videos all the updated uh important stock news and stock blogs all the ones that you want to have all in one place and i have my daily calls with my daily charts all right here and uh, and the daily watch list and some of the good trading books and everything else there. So just to give you a little idea what the site looks like for the new people out there. And uh, it's always being worked on. So definitely check it out. Come on by. Uh, day, tra day Trading Radio, it's actually. This is Day Trader Radio. This is Day Trader Radio. Day Trader Radio dot com. But it's Day Trading Radio dot com. And uh, actually, that'll bring, both of them bring you to the same place. And I hope, you, uh, hope to see you there tomorrow. This is uh, Day Trader Rockstar. I'm going to work on the site a little bit more. Um, I'm heading out of here. Enjoy it. Enjoy the evening.